Okay, let's go ahead and see how much we can get done this time. So, let's go to polygon mode. And I'm going to build a table. So, let's go ahead and get a box. And let's draw out our tabletop. And that'll look that'll do pretty good there. Let's bring our table up. Don't want it to be too thick, of course, you know. Okay, that looks pretty good right there. So now let's go ahead and run some loop slices with Alt C, count of two. I'm gonna make it symmetry. And I'm gonna put them about right there. Like that. Then I'm gonna do the same thing up this way. Alt C, and I'm going to put them about like that. Now, what this is going to do is, I'm going to go ahead and even these up a little. Now I can extrude, and we can make our legs here. So let's go ahead, go into polygon mode. We'll select our four corners. And I'm going to use the B key instead of the extrude command it's just personal preference and I'm going to shift click bring it down shift click bring it down shift click bring it down and shift click bring it all the way down to the bottom like so now we have us a table so now let's stick it back in the back so we can roughly size it up here yeah. Okay, now let's get the R key so we can adjust the scale on this. That's looking pretty good there. I guess it could be a little taller. Okay, now let's go ahead and run a loop slice up the middle. Count of 1, 50%. Okay. Now let's go to vert mode and let's grab our middle verts here. And let's drag them down just to skew this table a little bit like that. And if you want to grab this edge and move it over just to make it a little off kilter you can. Let's go back to vert mode and let's grab these. Let's pull them out like that. Let's grab these bottom ones and pull it out like so. Let's grab these back ones. And we're just skewing these, you know, just to make them look a little off kilter to flow with the theme of our geometry here, of our scene. So let's go ahead and adjust some of these others. Just try not to make it too monotonous, you know, the same old pattern. Just do the best you can. So, now let's grab these, I'm going to bring them forward just a tad, and maybe in, and this one here, we'll take it back, and in. Okay, now we have our little skewed table there. Let's go ahead and go to polygon mode and select it. Let's copy and paste it, and bring it over, like this. This one I'm going to make a little bit longer than that one like so just so they're a little different okay now we're gonna go in here and I'm gonna rotate this 180 degrees just so the legs aren't exactly the same you know and then I can go in and take that edge and move it way back over here and down and I can even rotate that edge to make it look like it's tilting just a tad. Okay. Now we have our two tables. So let's go in here now. Let's go to our box. And let's select our box. And I'm going to copy it. Let's go back into the rest of our geometry and I'm going to well let's just go to our walls geometry and paste it in there and move it over like 
like so. And I'm going to scale it down. Like so. I'll bring it here. Scoot it back. Rotate it. Like so. Copy it. And let's send another one over here. Like so. Now I'm going to select all these boxes and cut them back out and put them in my box layer with my other two boxes. With my other big box over there. Let's see. Now we have our boxes and our big box and our tables. So now let's go in here and briefly, real quick, grab a cylinder. Let's draw out a cylinder. And let's up it like so. We'll make it tall, about like that. And that's a little big for my taste. So let's shrink it down. About like so. Let's bring it over. It's a little tall. Let's bring it down like so. Now let's, uh, let's loop select all of those. And I'm going to loop slice it with about a count of five and uniform. Let's click it. And that will slice up my little pole there. So now I can scale this out, make it just a little bigger. Okay, now let's take my top polygon here. And let's bevel it out with the B key. Bevel it way out like this. I'm going to bring it up. I'm going to shift click, bring it up again. Shift click, bring it in. Shift click, and bring it down. Like so. Let's do the same thing on the bottom here. Select that bottom polygon. I'm going to hit the B key and bevel it out. Like so. Bring it down. Shift click. Bring it down and bevel it out some more. Shift click. Bring it down. Okay, now we have this little lamp. So let's go to our vert mode. And let's skew this. So we'll take these verts. We'll move it over like so. We'll take these bottom ones, move them over. This is where these slices come into play that we put in there. Okay, now let's select this whole deal. And let's move it back here. Move it down, and we'll put it back in place here. Now we have that done. Copy and paste it, and let's bring a copy of it over here. Not like that. Okay, now we have our lamps and our tables. Okay, and we'll see you in the next movie.